Hmm, what's a baby? Is like shit. <laughs>
horrendous windy um, but we've just seen a few puffins you can't really get that close to one um, but it is just nice to see them sort of a couple of hours from home to the car it was ridiculously windy and you couldn't hear a word we were saying um, but yeah it's, it's nice to see the puffins really we saw them up at Farn Island a few years ago and they were really really close um, sort of almost within touching distance but you can't get that close here you can see them over the cliff sort of uh, flying in and, and flying back out um, but what I'll do is I'll put a couple of photos up <laughs> just so that you can see the puffins up at, at Farn Island which is in Northumberland um, but yeah they they're just lovely they they're sometimes called sea parrots and sometimes called sea clowns and that's because of the the colour on the beak but they don't actually have that colour on the beak all year uh, it's only when they come into land um, for, for breeding season and then when they're out and about uh, back in the sea uh, the beaks are, uh, are quite grey um, what else did we find out? They flap the wings. 400 times a minute they flap the wings, wings to stay in the air, which is horrendous. No wonder they move so fast. Um, the oldest one is in Northumberland. They normally live till 20 years old and they've got one in Northumberland that's currently still alive and it's 42. 42? 42. 42. Um, so yeah, we, we're going to um, have, a, have a bit of something to eat and mm. then go over to uh, Spurn Point. Um, so we'll see you later on. Adios. Adios.
Americans have the lovely time again uh, in Yorkshire. There's so much to see and explore and we can't wait to come back again. Um, so yeah, we're going to have some chilli meatballs and just enjoy the rest of our, our night. Yeah, drink in the hot tub. hot tub when we've done. Yeah, and we'll see you next time on our next adventure. Adios. Adios.